Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. This is my, my kit incubator videos here and I'm here to show you this Sino timer I have here and I've not seen any of this on any YouTube channel before that is why I'm here to talk about it and how to wire it. Sometimes some people mistakenly loop it to um, loop it like the first timer they they know of but this one is a different thing altogether so right now i have the manual here which i have gone through it and um, they are all in english so if you think you might have difficulty reading it you won't so we'll put this aside because we are done with that and now we come to the timer so right now if you want to if you want to set this, I'll, I'll do that at the end of the video. So you have to watch till the end. So um, I have here a fan, 220 volts fan, and I'm going to use that so that you can see it moving. I have my wire here, my um, wire connector so that I can connect two wires together without um, being the traditional way of um, how do you call it um, um to binding them together yeah and i have my connectors here as you can see the jack connectors i have my power cable here i have my plier and that's all you need so right now let's get on to the video so i'm going to teach you how to wire the sino timer which people find it difficulty doing so you strip the wire and then you do this, you do this and then do the same to the other side and then fold it on top of the other and then put it in this, then clip very firmly the same to the other side. Hope you can see it the same to the other side and then clip very firmly okay so now we are done with this we have two different wires here we have one that is white with a red stripe so you can see it's white with red stripes and we have the pure white so the pure white is going to be our neutral and this is going to be our life so at the back of this you can see it says line newt newt load so line is our life newt is neutral right that's for the power side and then the output we have input and output the output is going to be four is going to be newt that's neutral and the five is going to be life so our life is the one with a red stripe so we will put that at five to so make sure it's in very well and put the plain one at mute so we'll do that to the power cable too as well so the power cable i've already stripped it already so we are going to do the same thing twist it fold it on top of the other the same to the other side fold it on top of the other and then put the jack in jack connector in and then clip it very firmly so that it doesn't come out the, the same to the other side so we all know blue is always neutral right so we are going to connect blue this blue to neutral that's newt and we are going to connect life which is brown to load a uh, line in so line and then we are going to strip the other side of this wires and then we we'll connect it to this connector right here so strip the wires and then you connect it 
make sure the wires are very straight so that it goes in and it doesn't remain outside so that it shocks you and then for the fan i've already stripped the wire so we are going to twist it and then put it in any other side of it and then you let go so let me bring the power source and then we test this out so here we have our power source so what you're gonna do now is you're gonna make sure your power is working so and we are going to make sure we've wired our timer correctly so i'm going to power this so you can see the fan is working and you can see there's a light at the top here so what you are going to do now is we have some numbers on oh sorry some um how do you call it some buttons here we have seconds we have minutes we have hours we have weeks we have clock we have program we have manual and this is a reset button so to see if it is working and not a direct power source you press manual so right now it's on on auto that means it's going to turn on at the time you set it and we have off so off and auto off which will tell us it's working so right now it's working so let's put it on on it's working so now our wiring is correct so now let's get down to the setting so right now if you want to set the clock we have to set the clock first so you press and hold down the clock button and then set the hour so you can set the hour to maybe let's say 10 o'clock and the minute to um 20 10 20 and then you can leave the se seconds because maybe you don't need the seconds so you let go of the clock and for you to program this so that it works according to the clock so right now it's 10 20 so we are going to program the one on to be 10 sorry sorry 10 you have to do this fast 10 11 sorry i cross the line again <laughs> 10 11 so we are going to make it 10 11 and the minute should be 11 sorry the the one on should be 10 10 um 10 should the one on should be 10 19 okay one on should be 10 sorry 10 20 it should be 10 20 so make one ninety, uh, one on ten twenty, and make. So you press program again to shift it to ten off. Make ten off. Sorry, one off should be ten twenty one. Since are very hard to track. Ten twenty one. Twenty one then you press clock to go back so right now our auto on starts now and when it ends let's see what happens when it ends so it's supposed to cut but because i've not set it for it to cut i'm going to set it for it to cut so one on is 10 20 one off is 10 21 two on should be two 
two on should be 10. Let's make that 10, 23. And make two of 10, 20, so right now it's okay so right now it should come on think hold on for coming let me get this right um, two on two off okay so it should go off right around 1024 so let's wait for 1024 and see if this goes off So you see i didn't press anything and it's off so guys that's how you set your sino timer and um yes and one thing too you have to set the weeks right so whilst you're in program you press weeks to set it so you set it to all the weeks right for you to get your accurate time so you can see i've set it to all the weeks monday tuesday wednesday saturday sunday okay so thank you guys and um please give me a like like this video so that we get about thousand likes so that we can do more videos about it and do more videos about more stuff thank you guys for watching leave a comment down below on what you want me to do and um, subscribe we need more subscribers to do more videos thank you guys Stay tuned.